Hey, I'm Bob. I've been totally blind since birth and I'm into Star Wars. We're going to be taking a look at an action figure and a mini rig from the 2008 Clone Wars animated series line. So let me bring forth the ATRT as it appeared in the Clone Wars animated series. So here is our walker. And I'm going to have to try to show this from various angles. It's a bit of a bigger vehicle, so I would think holding it up about that high might work because it is a higher vehicle, but I'll raise it and lower it. So in terms of the animation for the 2008 series, this ATRT it looks a little skinnier to me than the Revenge of the Sith version that we got in uh, 2005, six thereabouts. But other than that, looks like pretty much the same ATRT. And you can move the legs. We'll uh, try to demonstrate that a little bit. The feet can move back and forth. The uh, foot pads can bend, that kind of stuff. Let's see here. I have an ARF trooper seated on the walker as they appear in the 2008 animated series here. So we'll turn this walker around. Of course, it's got the, the antennae on the back here, just like our Revenge of the Sith ATRT does. I'll take the ARF trooper off of the walker so you can get a better look at it. The action figure here. This is a very, very loose ARF trooper. Uh, he's got multiple points of, uh, of articulation, so you can move him around, seat him on his walker. I'm just looking for his uh, DC-15S here. Doesn't really want to stay in his right hand. So you know what? We'll just put the blaster aside for a sec. All right. <laughs> Here's our ARF Trooper from the Clone Wars animated series. He's wearing his Phase 1 armor, I do believe. Very loose in the legs, but I suppose that's okay. You can spread his legs at the hips. I think this one could have come with a, uh, a bark speeder. I'm not quite sure, though, because uh, you're able to have this guy do the splits so he can sit, I guess, on either the Bark Speeder or the ATRT Walker. So, and I don't think this is one of the ARF troopers that were actually named. I don't think it's Waxer or Boyle from the animated series. I think this is just a random ARF trooper you can actually use on a Bark Speeder or an ATRT. Let me try to find his little blaster. I think he might hold it a little better in his left hand. So we'll see if he can hold the DC-15 a little better in the left hand. There we go. Very loose action figure. But uh, if you just use him for being seated on a walker or a Bark Speeder, should be just fine. Now I'm going to grab the Revenge of the Sith ATRT because I still have it on my desk. Figured we might do a bit of a comparison here. So here's the other walker. I like this one a little better just because it looks a bit more filled out, a bit more bulky. So here is the other walker. I think the ATRTs are some of my favorite prequel walkers. I do really enjoy the ATTE. We took a look at that quite a while back on this channel. You can find that review on the Star Wars playlist. I always try to put a link to the playlist in the uh, description just in case people want to see some older videos. And once again, here's the animated style ATRT. -E 
Anywho, that'll do for this uh, bit of review and comparison. And I will hear you guys next time. May the force be with you. And uh, watch where you're stepping.